Hello students, welcome back. Let us continue with chapter 10 circles, exercise 10.4 on page 179. The first question, we have two circles with centers O and O dash. The uh, radius of the largest circle is 5 centimeters, so OP is equal to OQ which is 5 centimeters. And we have the radius of the smaller circle, o, o dash P is equal to O dash Q is equal to 3 centimeter each. Now we have connected these two centers to draw the line segment O O dash. This length is 4 centimeters. I haven't marked it here because already there are a lot of lines and curves over here. But this is written out here that length O O dash is 4 centimeters. Now I need to find the length of the common chord P Q. If you notice this circle here, P Q is the common chord. Uh, P Q is the chord for your circle with center O. And if you notice this circle here, P Q is again the chord. Now L is the point of intersection of this common chord and the line segment OO dash. I need to find the length of length PQ. So I need to find the length of the common chord PQ. So I'm going to simplify this figure for you. This is P, this is Q. You have L over here, you have O dash and you have O. Now each of these angles at the center is a right angle. Why would you say that? Because it's been given that the distance, so the important point I'm emphasizing on distance, the distance between these two centers is 4 centimeters. Distance is nothing but the perpendicular drawn from the center of the circle to the chord. So each of these is 90 degrees okay that's why I have marked boxes for these angles and also I will have LP is equal to LQ why is LP equal to LQ because perpendicular is drawn from the center of the circle to the chord bisects the chord so let us write down these points first then we'll go about finding the distance of length PQ or common chord PQ so I will say proof O O dash length O O dash is equal to 4 centimeters therefore O L is perpendicular to P Q and O L sorry O, o L is perpendicular to P Q and O L dash is also perpendicular to P Q correct therefore angle O L O dash L P is equal to angle PLO is equal to angle OLQ is equal to angle QLO dash is equal to 90 degrees right because see we, because this has already been given and also you have PL is equal to QL why because perpendiculars drawn from center of the circle to the chord bisects the chord I'll mark this as 1 now notice that the length OO dash is 4 centimeters. So if I say let OL be x centimeters, O dash L be x centimeters, then OL will be 4 minus x centimeters. Correct? Let's write this down. Now, length of O dash O or OO dash is equal to 4 centimeters. This is given. Let O dash L be equal to x centimeters. Therefore, O L will be 4 minus x centimeters. Let's mark this as 2. So now here is the catch of your question. The first catch. We are going to take these two right angle triangles into consideration. We have this length as 5. We have this length as 3. Therefore, P L is going to be uh, in the right angle triangle P L O. You are going to have 
पी एल स्क्वायर इज गोइंग टू बी पी ओ स्क्वायर माइनस ओ एल स्क्वायर वाई बिकॉज दिस इज द हाई पॉटन यूज आउट हेयर और यू कैन जस्ट राइट पी ओ स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू पी एल स्क्वायर प्लस एल ओ स्क्वायर देर फोर पी एल स्क्वायर इज गोइंग टू बी पी ओ स्क्वायर माइनस एल ओ स्क्वायर ना वाई एम आई एम्फोसाइजिंग ऑन पी एल बिकॉज पी एल इज द कॉमन लाइन बिटवीन दीज टू ट्राइंगल्स आउट हेयर एंड फॉर दिस ट्राइंगल पी एल स्क्वायर इज गोइंग टू बी पी ओ स्क्वायर माइनस एल ओ स्क्वायर which is 3 square minus x square then whatever we get we are going to equate this then we are, we will be able to find the length of x that is length lo and then we can accordingly find the other lengths also so now in right angle triangle triangle pol i have pl square is going to be po square minus ol square according to pythagoras theorem so i'll say pythagoras theorem therefore pl square is going to be what 5 square minus 4 minus x the whole square so let's solve this 5 square minus 16 minus 8x plus x square this is pl square therefore pl square is going to be equal to 5 square is 25 minus 16 so we are opening the bracket therefore this will become minus 16 then we have Minus into minus, so this will be plus eight x, and minus into plus will give me minus, so minus x square. So P L square is going to be twenty five minus sixteen is how much? Nine plus eight x minus x square. Let's mark this as statement number three. and now let's take a look at the triangle plo dash so in triangle in right angle triangle plo dash i have pl square is equal to po dash square minus lo dash square so this is going to be 3 square Minus x square, which is nine minus x square. This is P L square. Let's mark this as four. Now look at three and four. Both are equal to P L. Now equals that are equal to the same thing are equal to each other. Therefore, from three and four, you have these two right hand sides equal. I'm erasing this section for now. Therefore, I have nine plus eight x minus x square is equal to nine minus x square, and I'll say from three and four. Now, see, we have equal terms x minus x square and minus x square from both sides. When you subtract equals from equals, the remainders are equal. Therefore, we are going to subtract minus x square from both sides. Therefore, I'm going to get also here I have nine and nine. so i'm going to subtract 9 and x square minus x square from both sides therefore i will get 8x is equal to 0 therefore x is equal to 0 upon 8 therefore x is equal anything uh, that divides 0 the answer is going to give you 0 so therefore x is equal to 0 now if you come back to your diagram out here let me simplify the diagram once again for you see x is 0 that means ol is 0 that means the points l and o coincide that means l lies on the center of your small, smaller circle so i'm going to simplify this diagram for you to understand better just drawing a smaller version of it
this is the center O is equal to L. We have this as the length PQ, correct? And also you have your circle like this. The larger circle also has the chord here. Passing through the points PQ. Correct? So this is your O, this is your O dash or L. So obviously PQ becomes the diameter of your smaller circle. We have PO dash as 3, that is the radius of the smaller circle. Therefore, this length PQ is going to be 6 centimeters, which is the length of your common chord. So let's write this down. Since x is equal to 0, it implies that L and O dash coincide. That is, L lies, L is the center of the circle, of the circle with radius 3 centimeters. Therefore, chord PQ passes through O dash. Therefore, PQ is the diameter of the circle. Circle with 3 centimeter as radius. Therefore, length of PQ is equal to 6 centimeters. Why is the length as 6 centimeters? Because we know that the diameter of the circle is twice its radius. So you can write that down or even this is enough. Since it is the, uh, it is the PQ is the diameter of the circle with radius 3 centimeters. Therefore, length of PQ is 6 centimeters. And here is the catch that L and O coincide. So this was about the first question. We'll continue with the remaining questions in the next videos. Thank you. Hope this video increased your knowledge. For more such videos and a completely free educational content, log on to www.epathshala.org or visit our Epathshala YouTube channel. We have each and every question solved for maths, physics, chemistry and biology. So subscribe our channel, share with your friends, like our Facebook page and follow our Twitter handle for regular updates and important educational tips and also win Epathshala goodies. So what are you waiting for? Subscribe this channel and enjoy the freedom of education.